to follow that is with frivolous fashion. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, there's no segue to be made except that, of course, we do love fashion on the show. And the People's Choice Awards were held last night in LA. Uh, and you know, it means a lot of red carpet fashion. And yeah. so we are going to grab these moments because there were some great ones. Uh, and Neil, uh, you probably picked one, I'm sure, out of the many celebs that were on the red carpet. Did you have a fave? It was really tricky. I went with Ellen Pompeo. Yes. Uh, oh, yeah. Good job. Oh. It, 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 you know, I like the, I like the rainbow. Oh. The good choice, Neil. The pizzazz. It matched nice the cover of my suit. book. Oh, my I was, uh, oh. <laughs> I was like a jumpsuit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's just it's about it's just about color. It's about color. Bringing it up, it like just a little just, happiness. It, it yeah. makes me happy, like your sweater. Oh Jess. my god! Very oh, yeah, oh, it's disco kind of realness. No, too. I was gonna yeah. choose this one too. This was a good look for her. She looks yes. really great in that one. My choice is oh. yeah. Oh, I hear that they're clapping already. Dwayne Wade. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> okay. First of all, can we just drink in this double chocolate goodness here? <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Okay, so he's wearing a purple Louis Vuitton jacket, Louis Vuitton print shirt, and custom pants. And not only does he just look handsome and he could make anything look good, but this is really special, this outfit, because it was the part of the last collection from Virgil Abloh, oh, who was the artistic yes. director of the Louis Vuitton menswear line. And Dwayne and Virgil were friends. It's almost a year to, his, to the date of his death. They were friends, and he said on the red carpet he wanted to honor his friend, and this oh. was the best way he knew how. And I thought, you know what, not only do you look good, but this is also something really special because it's from his last collection. So. And oh you know what I love is that for men watching, because we do a lot of women's fashion, this is actually just a note for you, Neil, and all yeah. the other men out there. You see that silhouette that was on that look is the wide-legged pant. Yeah. It's a oh. higher waist. Uh -huh. It's a wide-legged pant. We've seen men for a very long time doing the, the short, short, no under socks. Under the belly button. Under the yeah. belly button, but very really high, like almost Very high above high the ankle. Jack it up. Jack it up. Yeah. A little yeah. floods. A little floods, it's a changing. lot of ankle. Although yeah. we are describing your outfit right now. I just <laughs> totally lost. You look great. <laughs> you, you look great. It was a beautiful story. Let me yeah. um, bring it down a bit because <laughs> almost all the Real Housewives of Beverly Hills mm. were there last night. So picking a favorite is kind of like picking your favorite kid. Mm -hmm. But um, I went with Sutton Strack only because she shopped her own closet, which I thought was really, really beautiful. Oh, nice. So she has this gorgeous dress on, these that cute little clutch and the, the beautiful jeweled heel. Shoes but are my good. favorite part... Oh, I just spit. Sorry, I'm so excited. My favorite part is the necklace when she turns around and I. Oh, I can't wait. I was wanting to see the back. Look at that. Look at that. Yes. Isn't that gorgeous, you guys? Fabulous. So good. And that is, that is by a Canadian designer named Alan Anderson who makes like one of a kind pieces, I think using a lot of vintage uh, jewelry. Oh. But I just thought that That's was just gorgeous. Good you know, luck. she should have reversed onto the red carpet. That's oh a better God. shot. <laughs> yeah, but I, yeah, it's gorgeous. I think her girls would have been out if she reversed that dress. Well, that's she how Melissa would have worn it. That's oh, how mean, Melissa. You mean, you know, walking backwards. Moonwalking moon moon walk. moon her way yeah. off the red that's carpet. That's right. Okay. Gotcha. That's right. <laughs> Gotcha. <laughs> my, my pick for the best look on the red carpet was the person who won for People's Champion last night, and that is the one and only Lizzo. Oh. Yeah. Wow. I, I'm going to tell you why I love this look. First of all, she looks like a million dollars. Mm -hmm. Absolutely everything from her makeup to her hair to her nails to her jewelry to the look. This is an Alexander McQueen look. And the reason why I jumped when I saw this was not only does she look amazing, but do you remember not that long ago mm -hmm. when haute couture houses of Paris Oof. and Italy, they just wouldn't dress a curvy girl. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. They just said, nope, we don't dress anybody over a size six, sorry. Mm -hmm. And so uh, all of a sudden her sporting this Alexander McQueen piece of art, I was like, you know what? She is making a change yeah. single-handedly. Yeah. So there's Absolutely. I want to wear that. Love yeah, that. That's great. Hey there, wasn't that great? Do you know where you can find some equally good content? Our YouTube page. It's filled with discussions, debates, and some laughs. Head there now, like and subscribe.